When you're doing number bonds to 100 using multiples of 10, it's useful to know your number bonds to 10. It makes this much easier and quicker to learn. If you're not sure about those, check that video out first. For example, you know that 9 add 1 is 10. You can use that information to work out some of your number bonds to 100. So 90, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, add another 10 is 100. And if you compare those numbers from the number bond to 10, we've just multiplied each number by 10 to get the number bond to 100. So 9 has been multiplied by 10 to 90, 1 has been multiplied by 10 to 10, and 10 has been multiplied by 10 to 100. Have a go at this one. 60 add what is 100? Use what you know about your number bonds to 10. If you know that 6 add something is 10, think about what that something is, and you've added on 4. So if 6 and 4 is 10, 60 add what is 100? Pause the video, have a go. Our 60 red blocks are on there. How many do we need to add? 10, 20, 30, 40 blocks. And if you compare those numbers to the number bonds to 10, 6 and 4 is 10, 60 add 40 is 100. 20 add what is 100? Use your number bonds to 10 to work this out. Pause the video, have a go. Two add something is 10. Two add eight is 10. So 20 add 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80 is 100. And the same works with subtraction. If you know that 10 take away eight is two, you can work out that 100 take away 80 is 20. 100 take away 30. Use your knowledge of the number bonds to 10 to work this out. Pause the video, have a go. 10 blocks take away 3 and you have 7 left. 100 blocks take away 30 and you have 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70 left. 